Roberto Di Matteo, proud Italian, has decided has been given a two-year contract at Chelsea. Um, why the delay? Probably trying to see, you know, if this is the right thing to do. I was actually astonished that they were waiting that long. I actually think it's a bad decision to make. Ooh. He's not the right person to lead a project. He's the right person for when the team is under pressure. They need to win. You know, they've got nothing really going for them. And it's a case of just getting the old guard on board and trying to win as many games as possible when everyone thinks you're going to lose them. So well, Why don't you think he's the right appointment? Because it's about Chelsea needs to change there. You know they've got the old guard. Just won the they Champions League and the FA Cup. It's not about that. It's, you, you know, it, you're it, a hard task, Mark. Goodness me, I, I, am, I, I am. hate you when you become an editor of your paper. We <laughs> 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 we start every this five minutes. This is how isn't I've there? reached the position I've reached. <laughs> 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 this is the way I roll. But it's a case of you know you have to be able to pick out these youth talents that would make a great team. You have to nurture them into their roles, develop them. He's got some great talents like Hazard, um, Juan Mata, possibly Hulk. You know, you, you need to know how to play these guys and nurture them into these roles. It's and not about getting do that? because he doesn't have the history of being able to do that. He's not someone who necessarily can get he played players. attractive football at West Bromwich Albion. He, he did defensively he really badly when though. Up, when they got up, yeah, because he came to the Premier League with a team and that wasn't not, good enough for them. He's not really been known. Okay, he's not. I agree what with that. What more could he have done? What what more could he have done this season? It's Apart not from about that, the it's about starting well. a new project. Look at Ranieri, yeah? You don't need a new He's project, Chelsea, you've got one. You know they're long enough at Chelsea Look. to have a project, aren't you? I mean, the, the only one that was there yeah, long enough to have a project. Yeah, but they want to start a project. Well, Listen, they they sacked the manager that started it in Mourinho, the best manager they've ever had. In so Italy, we have a saying, you have you have a builder and you have a winner. So you have like, like a Claudio Ranieri, who's a builder, he knows how to put together a project. You bring in Mourinho, he wins it for you. That's what the difference is. Di Matteo, what he's proved now... I'd rather now have a winner than a builder. ...is that he's a winner. But you can't give a team like Chelsea the way that they nail. are now with nothing, you know, where they're still trying to put foundations together and be like, yeah, all right, go he, out and he win. Might, he might be what Chelsea need because they've gone for all the big ones, haven't they? They've gone for Scolari, they've gone for... Um, Pilash Boash. Boas, they they've gone they've for Hiddink, Hiddink, they've had Mourinho, yeah. they've, they've had all the big stars and they suddenly bring, I wouldn't say a down-to-worth character, but a man, is it, to be real, you've got to remember, he played for Chelsea as well. He gets he's, on with the, the players. He's the only, he's the only pl manager recently that's actually played for, played for them, um, since Fiali probably. He's got the players together, he settled down that group of players into, and tactically they were spot on. They knew they were never as good as Barcelona and Bayern Munich, but they stopped them scoring. And in fact, to take the Champions League final to penalties, wouldn't so have been you're trying to tell me that they were tactically smart, spot on, but they were not absolutely at all lucky in their games, and that they, they probably lucky. got through that on the back of you've great luck. Play Barcelona. No, no, no. Barcelona, Barcelona are, are a far better team. You've got to be lucky to be, get through. Exactly. So it's not really that he was a great tactician as such. I they mean, were, Fernando they were Torres to go out really to Barcelona conceded two a goal. years ago when they when they scored in the last minute at, yes. at Chelsea. So uh, you know, the, what did they say? Um, Caesar used to say, yes. "Don't bring me a good general." Yeah, don't be bring me a good general. Bring me a lucky general. That's what he said. Mm. I don't want to hear about good Can generals. Can he still be lucky, lucky again? I don't know. That, that, and we'll find out. And by Christmas, if results haven't gone his way, you can be sure his eggs are eggs. But he won't be they, 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 they wanted Guardiola. But um, this is they the thing. And Di Matteo is, is just a step over. There's, there's a break clause in the contract. Um, I think. I think. It, I think. You know. I think teams like Chelsea and that they can pay whatever and, and sign managers on one-year deals. I mean, because you know they've spent 34 million quid compensating managers over the last number of years. <laughs> yeah. So, um, and so Chelsea can pay top dollar and say to managers, you've got one-year contract. And managers could work, would work under that basis. If I do well, I'll have another contract next year at the top dollar. You know, more than anybody else can pay. And Di Matteo, he's done everything that was asked of him. He's still got Terry there. He's still got Lampard there. They'll still want to play next year. He's still got to keep those players on board. All right, um, Drogba has gone. Has he gone now? Definitely gone? Uh, Drogba, yeah. Drogba said he's, he's going, but he won't so, tell us where. But we, know, we think it's going to be China. China. Yeah. Um, I saw Real Madrid were interested in him, weren't they? No, well, he, yeah, he's, he's basically said it would be disrespectful to say where I'm going. All I'm saying is I've done everything I need to do for Chelsea and now I hand over the reins to Torres. That's what he said. But he hasn't said where he's going. <laughs> but, but it won't be handed China. over to Torres.